Tell us about the Cinemeric One. What does this mean for the Siemens product line? Wow, so the Cinemeric One is a big step forward for Siemens in uh, our capabilities. And it's really the next in a series of controls that have really driven technology in the market. The biggest thing is it's just so flexible. It can do so many things. The world is kind of your oyster. You can have it run on any kind of machine. It can be configured a lot of different ways. It's very conversational. You walk up to it and it's intuitive and easy to learn. The Cinemark One was designed as the first digitally native CNC controller, as a, as a virtual uh, CNC controller and of course as a real CNC controller. Siemens has developed the Cinemeric One to be relevant far into the future in two different ways. First, this concept of the digital twin. The Cinemeric One hardware and software has been designed explicitly to work with the digital twin. And this digital twin concept is an important concept today, but it'll even be more so in the future as connectivity and automation and other software products evolve wrapped around this idea. It really is a accumulation of six decades of development. And if you take the combination of the software optimization and taking the latest generation of hardware and combine those two together, you really do get the highest performing CNC controller on the marketplace today. The key thing that you get with the Senior Merrick One platform is access to the digitalization tools. So that includes the digital twin, that includes the MindSphere and being able to access and manage the machines remotely. These are things that are definitely going to give you increased productivity. Secondly, the Cinemeric One is a relatively open platform, and that means Siemens is going to continue to develop applications, but other developers can build applications as well in connectivity, automation, that will work on this control, and we are one of those developers. We want to push the envelope of what is possible. And we think that that's really what's been driving advanced technology. And the Cinemark One is really doing that, especially in the digitalization portfolio or the industry 4.0 world. It's allowing us to incorporate functions that traditionally couldn't be in a CNC control in this new open platform. On the machine side, the main thing is simply performance. Uh, we bought one of their uh, controls 15 years ago. We have a test uh, program called the Ball Bar, and it had the best one I've ever seen. And I've checked our own equipment, I checked some of our competitors' equipment, and it was like the best one I've ever seen. And so when the opportunity came up, I said, you know, if we go with Siemens, I already know what I'm going to get for machine performance. What Siemens does is it has a very innovative approach where we look at polynomial curve fitting. And what that means is we can take tens or hundreds of points, put a high order polynomial through there, and then instead of you know, processing 100 blocks, you're processing one algorithm. It not only decreases the amount of data that the controller is trying to process, but it also smooths out the paths. So you get better surface finishes and you also get um, reduced cycle times. It allows parallel design work. For the machine builder, they can do parallel engineering. For the end customer, they can do parallel part programming or parallel resource management. 